listen, Portland are a sick team, innit? But Harold, my, my, that's my boys, bro. So I'm going to go 3 2 Harold. Frenchie, what are you saying? What score do you reckon? Portland, yeah? <laughs> I'm not going with this 3 1 bullshit. Man, ever remember again. your ends, bro. Just remember your ends, bro. Where you're from, innit? Remember I know where I'm, boys, from. I'm from. I'm from your fresh city. <laughs> yeah, that's where I'm from. Your fresh city, baby. Boys, you know. Yeah? I know, listen, do you know what I'm gonna say? I'm gonna say it in my chest. I'm gonna say nil nil. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say 2 1 Portland. Ooh. Do you want, no, do you know what I'm going to say? 2-1. Because someone ain't playing today. I don't know. I don't know. Someone not playing today. <laughs> <laughs> to make, oh, sorry, this is French if you don't know already. Yeah, no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I follow you on Twitter. Yeah, I know who he is. Fucking hell. I love this guy. 3-1 Portland, yeah? Yeah. Okay, um, what about Your first TV Sports, Sunday League FA Cup, Harrow Sports v Portland, Harrow Port Sports are lined up in a 4 3 3. Joe in goal, Simo at left back, Jake Hill, Kush, and Tommy at right back. Jake Francis will anchor a three man midfield with El Capitano, Bass, uh, Alex Hallett, and the front three will be Nathan playing off the left, Casey off the right, and Jimmy Graham as a nine dog. Um, subs will be Era, Barouge, Rickson, Rose, and Charlie. Um, Harrow Sports, I know a lot of their players, good bunch of boys, local lads. Alex Hallett, Jimmy Graham, and I'll definitely say Jake Francis are the three to look out for. We know what people like Bass are all about. He's a machine, they give you 100%. But I'd definitely say that Jimmy Graham's a fox in the box. I'm sure he's a top goal scorer as well. He looked to get goals in this game and uh, do well for the camera. But Jake Francis, Alex Hallett, and Jimmy Graham are definitely three standout players. We now go into the Portland side who are also playing the 4-3-3 team we know very well. Big Sam Freeman in goal, Hanif at left back, Cocky and Kaz at centre half with Mitch at right back. So Owen Price will anchor a three man midfield with Ryan Darcy and Yusuf helping him out in there. Um, Jay Burt will play off the right of a front three, Bobby as a nine and Kimon as a left of the three. Subs will be Anis, Merrick, Mo, Ramel and Dan Burnett. Looking at that lineup, Owen Price will definitely look to keep things ticking over. We know about big dog Ry Darcy, that fake shot roll is definitely coming out the bag today. And Lee Cook will definitely lead by example, as well as a big, big, big character in Sam Freeman. So we're straight into the game. Portland will get us underway. Goes back into Ry Darcy Smith. Darcy Smith into Price, who finds, who finds Youssef, who goes back into Lee Cook, and they look to go forward. And it gets cut out. I think I think I think uh, Harris will try and press high today. Jimmy Graham be nice and bright. Sam Freeman on the ball looks to set. It's a big pitch, so I wouldn't be surprised if both teams try to play a little bit as well today. As you can see, Sam Freeman trying to get out of his hands straight away, but still goes long, forced into that decision as well. I wonder how Portland are going to set up without no Frenchies and nine dog today. That'll be a very big miss as well. Back in it, Bass Bass on the ball is a unit of a man, mountain of a man. Still has the ball, Mr. Muscle. You can't get the ball from him. Free kick, there's about three, three, three Jack Russells biting his ankles and he wins the free kick at the end with Bass. But Nathan has the ball on the left hand side with supports from Simo, goes inside. Great dig by Alex Hallett. Bass on the ball, he doesn't usually get this far out of the pitch, he normally gets a nosebleed. Yeah, and it goes back in there to the boss of the shot and he's dragged it wide. Sam Freeman looked comfortable with it. So we're back on the ball and that man Bass is back on the ball again. He's seen a lot of the ball early doors. El Capitano leaving by example. Goes back into Jake Hill, very big player as well, lead by example, goes into the right back. Tommy Backshaw, Tommy Backshaw's a strong lad as well, he'll work his fucking bollocks off. Anyway, referee plays his advantage, we go to a great feet by Hanif. Sold him a dream, dream selling again, but we get the free kick, game stopped. So Aaron Leacott would definitely want to pitch this in, but already really play short. So a lot of options on at the minute, but Harrow Sport press nice, press in there nice and nice and tight, stop them from playing, which is good from them by the way. So Aaron Leacock sprays the ball out to the right hand side. Great touch. Can he beat him? Gets crossing. Great block by Simo. Nathan well done, He's very strong and he carries the ball upfield into Jake. This kid's a player by the way. Satnav plays it nice and short this time. But watch him he get on the ball nice and deep and he loves the shot. Anyway, Harrow working their way up the pitch. Alex had it on the ball now, goes back out to the fullback. Fullback thinks, oh, that's actually that's actually Jake who plays the ball in. Sam Freeman comfortably. 
Believe me, Jake, he's just finding his range. So we're going to Owen Price, who will definitely try and start counter-attack. Get some work, keep a tick over. Gabe Lowe outside of the foot into Bobby. Bobby's a very bright player as well. Give you 100% for everything and works really hard. So we're going to the right back again. And he's been dispossessed too easy. So Nathan the ball. Could have turned and gone forward. Back into Basel Capitano. He plays it nice and short to Jake. He's working his way out the pitch. Plays it across to Alex Hallett. He's probably surely going to go one more. And he slides to Jimmy Graham. And Jimmy Graham's in. If you would have played that a little bit earlier, Jimmy Graham's one-on-one -on -one with the keeper there. So we're back in with the right back. He goes into Kush. Kush goes back to the keeper. Keeper looks up, looking to play out of the back. Decent from Harrow. They've had a decent amount of possession to start with. Um, giving Portland things to think about. Balls think full. Oh, that's a great touch by Jimmy Graham. Swivels, gives it to Bass. Bass, you should have slid him in there, boy. His X button must have been broken, his controller. Yeah, but he still drives forward. Get up. Bass nicking three kicks. I've seen a new side to Bass today. He's normally a fullback. Oh, and is that Jake? Oh, nice. Alex Hallett takes a free kick and it's off the bar. That's the bar. So corner's whipped in. Again, I think that's touched Ryan Darcy's head. Great header, defensive header. Jake ushers it out and picks it up to take the throw in quick. Yeah, you can see Dan Burnett is obviously not happy with what's going on at the minute. They were hard done by the week before by Ken Kenningwell, so they want to win this game. So we're back in throwing with Harrow Sports. Throws into Jimmy Graham, who tries to pin. Ha Get a crossing. Jake's selling the ball. If it ain't on, he ain't going to give it. And he plays a ball in, in the end. Great attack and head up, but it goes over the bar. Jake back on the ball. He's starting to come in the game more and more. I told you before the game, he's a decent player. Great technical ability. He, he looked to get set things off and set attacks. So it goes down the left hand side and sure that's Bass in behind again. The kid's been everywhere to start with. Done really well. That's a great, that's a great pass by Bass, to be fair. Plays it back out. Tommy Batch has a pass. Well, it's not a pass, it's a shot. Sorry, T. <laughs> Sam collects it. So we're in Harrow's defensive third on the far side. Bobby's 1v1, can he beat the defender? Oh, great feet. Beats the defender, gets a cross in, easy for the keeper. Both teams seem really, uh, a lot of the ball early doors. But it's been easy for both keepers, not been real, real chances. Although here at Harrow's hit the bar, it, was, it wasn't really worrying. Sam Freeman out the side, goes early doors into the centre back. Centre back carries forward, gives it to Cocky. Cocky's going to look to spray, saying there's nothing on. Pops it inside, moving forward for Yusuf. Yusuf gets his head up, looking for Ryan Darcy Swift, but telegraphed it too much. Bass keeps it to kill over, goes into Jake Francis yet again. He looks to set Jimmy Graham off nice and early, but it's intercepted, great defending. So we go back into the left back, and even another great player, he will put you in the sky, but technically he's very good as well. Known him for a while, he's a good player for Portland. So Portland going into Pricey again in central midfield. He's very important for them today. He's going to keep them ticking over into fake shot right. He sprays it out. Find a sat nav of his own. And go to the right hand side with Jay Burke. Jay Burke on the ball again. Goes into Ride Dog. Ride Dog's using his strength and got really done really well. Keeps the ball. Back on the ball. He's going to fake shot and roll. No, not yet. It's not really. It's not that time. He's only got a certain amount in the bank. So anyway, Portland, good spur of possession here for Portland. They've kept the ball really well. They're not forcing, forcing the, the, the situation. They're trying to find decent openings to try and get a goal. Pops it in there to Jay Burke. Jay Burke has a pass back. Anyway, and that's Harrow Sports on the counter attacks, ushered out by the centre back again. Great defending. He's had a great start to the game, to be fair. Goes back into Sam Freeman, who don't mind playing out with his feet. Dinks it out here into, the, into Bangham. Bangham touches it over Jake Francis' head, but it's gone to no one. Bass is back on the ball again. The, the, I think these both, both these teams need to try and take the safeties off, man, because it's getting a bit boring. Yeah, but anyway, either, either way, possession stats must be decent in there because they're keeping the ball really well. Pricey on the ball again. Goes into Mitch. There's a great little ball into Bobby, and Bobby tries to flick it on and try and get Jay Burke in. But Simo's ready, and the keeper comes out and collects the ball. Back in the game, back in the game. Pricey on the ball trying to set a counter attack into Rai. Rai goes into Bobby. Bobby comes back into Yusuf. Goes into. Come on, back into Rye. Comes out to Bangle. Just They're keeping the ball really well, Pop, Portland. There's just not much tempo to it, but either way, they're keeping the ball well, trying to find that little opening. But will it come, though? Great first touch. Hey, shoot! There it is. I'm telling you, bro, he sucks me in every time. Anyway, we go back outside to the left-hand side. Portland have had the ball for about 10 hours. Get a shot off and it goes over the bar. 
Sima throws it back into Jake. Jake's dropping in deep to get on the ball. He started the ball for the last couple of minutes, so he wants to see it a bit more go into Jimmy Graham from Simo. Jimmy Graham got, tries to face him up, but loses the ball. Goes into Bobby. Bobby goes into... Ooh, why? That was a double mix. You lot owe him £10 all round. So we go out to Naif. Naif is one-on-one -on -one with Bangham. Bangham will put you in the sky. Do you know who he is? Now you've met. Ride Dog flicks it over the head of, of Jake Francis who gives it to Bobby. Bobby's in. Kimon's on the ball now. Can he finish? Nick is dispossessed, I believe, by Kush. Great tackle. Back in the game. Ball's there centrally. Gets. To be fair, that was never going to the left back. I was supposed to go to the left and further, but it's still the same ball. All, all the same. Passes back on the ball. Travelling forward. This guy's an absolute beast, you know, that he's an athlete. He can play a bit as well. Try to play a give and go. But that's what happened when Bass shoots. <laughs> Owen Price gets his head up. Don't let him shoot, by the way. Oh, what a ball in that is. Bobby! Great goal. To be fair, I told you, if you leave Pricey on the ball and you give him time, he'll crucify you. Crucify you. To be fair, Harris wants to start war, but they went to sleep. Their keeper gets a strong hand, but he can only push it into the back of the net. 1-0 Portland. 1-0 Portland. Be good to see how Harrow respond because Harrow are a good team. Oh, there he is. Look, he wants to smile now. Gaffer, Burnett. <laughs> so we're back in the game. Portland back on the attack. I think Portland are grabbing the game by the Cojones now and they're back on the attack. Down the left hand. Wow. Is that not a foul? Jesus Christ, that's GBH. But anyway, Portland win it back again, trying to get a cross in, and they succeed. Ryan, how have you not had a touch and shot there, bro? Anyway, but no one gave him a shout, all the same. So anyway, Bass backs in. You can tell he's getting the ump now, I think. If he keeps his head, keeps me ticking over. Just go back to basics, Harold, because they're doing really well. But if you give Portland chances, they will crucify you. Ryan, dog, take the safety off. So we're back in the game. Portland in, in their own box, little touch over Tommy Backshaw's head. We go forward really quick, 2v2. Great defending by Jake Hill, great player. Moves forward, the ball carries out the ball like an old school JT. Plays in Jimmy Graham, he's got a finish. To be fair, I think that's one of them situations where you've got too much time to speak, to think, speak, think, to think. But um, Harris puts got, got a equaliser, that's 1-1. One, one. You go into half time and it's a different ball game. But Portland have the ball back again. So in central midfield, comes out to Bobby. Bobby's been all over the gap, man. He works so hard and he's a very good player as well. He's tricky and he's nippy, he's got good feet. Gets a cross in. Uh, he's got right about you, got finish. To be fair, Bobby again. I'm telling you now, he doesn't get enough, enough credit for what he does. He works his absolute bollocks off. He's got a goal today. And he could have had an assist there. Bass the man mountain again. He goes to the gym, definitely. Goes back into Jake. Bass gets it on a half turn, tries to set a counter. Plays the ball over the top. Go. That's definitely like your 10th offside. So Jake Francis on the ball again. Can he set something? Having a little moan up because nothing's on. He's going to go into the fullback, comes the other way. He's got his head up and looking up. Tries to go in, but that's easy for Lee Cop. Pauling will eat them balls up all day, especially when they're sitting deep as they are. Got to keep the ball moving left to right and find openings. Portland tried to set the counter attack nice and early. Jake Hill on the ball mops up at the back. Goes inside to Big Bass. Big Bass holds off another man. Licks the ball up someone's side of, side of their head. Goes into Jordan Simmer at left back. Decent left football goes inside on his right. But there's a little, little ball in between. Lee Cop just ate up Jimmy Graham and put him in his pocket. So Ride Dog on the ball again. Tried a little trick, it didn't come off, but it's going into a pass. I'll give you that. I see you, right? Yeah, I see you. So we're going to get Portland on the ball again. Central midfield, Ride Dog on the ball, looking for options. A lot, a lot of the ball's going side to side a lot today, so it means defensively both teams are playing well. So it's Portland back on the ball with Pricey. Pricey looking up. Goes into Lee Cop, skipper, El Capitano. Keeps his head up, tries to set another attack. Goes inside. Left back, Hanif bombing on, he's put him in. Keeper's done well to come off his line really quickly and mop up. Can they set a counter now? Free kick from the edge of the box, Cocky goes into the ball. Expect more from him, Mr. Stick that on YouTube. I wanted one of them moments. So anyway, Portland on the, on the, on the attack again. Get, they've got him in, in behind 
arrows back for a few times a day, just can't find that finishing, that little finishing touch. But you get, you get the feeling the longer Portland leave arrow in this game, the harder it becomes. There's only one goal in it. So we go forward, Nate sprays a lovely ball out to the right hand side, but it's dispossessed and Portland back on the ball. He's caught in late line, was given a free kick, and that's half time. Portland won. Harrow nil. Right, come on, mate. He's an absolute <laughs> buff. Right, the cup. blue, yes, see the blue ting? The blue ting is doing wonders, I am. Watch him, mate. Go turkey and get the teeth off. For fuck's sake, mate. You're for TV Sports. 45 minutes done. Portland won. Harrow nil. Thanos, big eighth. How do you think the game's gone so far? They ain't really played much football, but they're not really offering us a threat, so the ball's to go wide, just gotta just keep playing the same and get the result. So the results this What do you reckon, Eve? Eh? What I've seen, the fact it's been alright. The other teams are really not really threatening us too much. Obviously I back my boys, so. If you were playing, would you dominate? No, no comments still. <laughs> <laughs> Did you dominate this game? Can't do the both don't you, you do know dare sit you see on me, the fence. I don't sit on the fence. Don't like, sit for on me, the like the only thing they've offered is physical and they haven't even matched our physical. I see my man get lift up over here. I see my man get kicked down over there and there's a roll nutmeg. I'm sure we'll see that in the highlights. We just need another goal and then we'll settle and we can start start popping, making man start chase shadows and that. Yeah. Would you change anything right now? No, I wouldn't change anything. No, if just, anything, just... get the, get our wingers a bit wider and just keep hitting that diag. Because they don't want to get taken for a run. Because then they hold trimmings. My man's already displayed it. <laughs> decent, decent. Boys, that's 45 minutes done. We'll try and grab some other people while we're here. But yeah, 45 minutes to come. 45 minutes done. Portland 1. Harrow Sports nil. Got Big Rick with us. Yes, Big Rick. Rick, how do you think the game's gone so far? Oh, do you know what? It's been a tight game. The goal was good. I think Portland deserved their lead. Yeah. They've been the better team. But... I don't think Harrow have come out of second gear, third gear. I still think they got a lot more. Yeah. But I'm not going to lie, this is the first time I've watched any of them boys in that, that, that league. Yeah. And, uh, and they've changed my mind, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Decent, decent. definitely. definitely. Would you good. change anything if you're the Harrow gaffer right now? Yeah. If you're right, would you change anything? I wouldn't change none, of, I wouldn't bring no one else on, but change, I'll like, be telling them to, to move the ball quicker because mm -hmm. they're slowing the play down a lot in the midfield. That ca the, um, Harrow's captain's slowing the ball down a lot. Bass. Yeah, yeah, the captain's slowing it down the most, but he's probably been their best player though as well. What, you, how do you reckon this will finish? Listen, if, if, if Harrow can up their game, they can nick a goal out of this, but Portland looks strong, man. So, decent. So maybe, I think Portland win. Big love. So, second half. Back in the game. Portland on the ball, Kush bringing it forward, goes into the right back. Right back, Tommy on the ball, plays it down the line, little dink, great little dink into Bass. But Bass can't control it, so he gets nipped back. Goes into Jay Perk, great little touchdown for Rye, but he's got Tommy hustling and bustling him. He, he won't give him a minute's rest to be fair, I'll tell you that much. So he drops it back into Pricey, great feet by Pricey, but... Is that, what, that's a foul? So Pricey's won a foul there. Ref's going across to have a word with the line of... I'm not quite sure what's going on, but we're back in the game. Anyway, Jimmy Graham on the ball, plays the ball back in. So it's back into Alex Elliott. Jake Francis is on the ball. Do you know what? It's good to see Jake Francis playing in a more advanced role now. He definitely trying to un unlock the fences. Cross comes in. Sam Freeman connects it nice and easy. So anyway, Lee Cott looks up. Can he set a counter attack from here? He definitely try and dink it in, but with no Frenchie, there's no target man. So he tries to dink it in, but he's just possessed. Jake Francis on the ball, tries to set her a shot. Ah, oh, you beauty! Take a bow, son. Take a bow. What a fucking goal. I said at the start, Jake Francis, don't let him play. He's a baller, and he just showed you why in it, yeah? Because he can smash top bins from 40 yard. Had Sam Freeman backpedalling, didn't know where he was, don't even know what's going in the goal, still don't know where the ball is, but it's in the back of the net. 1-1, one, one, Harold. Yes? Love that. Now we have a game. We have a game. Fans are on the pitch. Gaffer's on the pitch. Lionel's on the pitch. Yeah? Game on. Yes, so I think we have a sub there. I think Merritt's coming to central midfield. Very good player. He can dominate games physically, but he's very good on the ball as well. Here he is right now on the ball. Plays a little dink in, but good defending by Jordan Simmons. Simmons goes out to Nath. Yes, and now Harrow have got the, the bit between their teeth to try to push on for a goal. Set off Jimmy Graham. Sam Freeman's really brave. Leacock on the ball, goes forward into Bass. Bass, you get four years for that touch, son. Oh, great feet, I told you he's got... Hey, get off me. 
Yeah, Bass, he had a bad touch and was not trying to let him dominate him in a physical sense. But anyway, Portland on the ball. Portland are becoming really sloppy now and that's only going to give Harrow encouragement to go on and try and push for a second goal. Great header by Tommy. Can we win the seconds? Get it down to fake shot right. Fake shot right goes into Merrick who rolls him like he weren't there. But it's easy for the keeper. Seen a few of these pass backs today. And here he is, magic feats coming on. Mr. Anis, Anis himself, great kid, great player, great attitude, big things to come. Definitely have a watch out for this kid in the future because he definitely turns heads. He definitely would have been disappointed that he didn't start though. He still looks pissed off. Anyway, Paul Harrow again still on, uh, on the offensive, goes out to Bass. Bass puts the ball in with Venom and it's a little scramble inside the box. Header back in, header back out, header back in. Not in, out, shake it all about. And Anis, I told you, he's nicked the ball off Jake's free, but great, great covering by Kush there to get it back in. And he's set Nath on the counter attack. Nath brings it down on the right, left hand side. Plays it back into Jordan Simmons. Got the ball near to the box. He's twisting, he's turning, he's definitely looking to. Oh, what a ball. That's a penalty. Ride dog. Don't leave him in the box because he can't tackle. Or is that pricey? Anyway, we're back, we're, we're back in the game, Portland trying to go forward, but Harrow forcing them back again. Ryan gets the ball and it comes back into the centre half. Centre half goes back into Mitch. Mitch tries to pitch one for up. He's played it for about four players. Great pass by Mitch. Set back to Ryan Dog. Ryan goes back inside. Gets Anis on the ball. Anis is hungry to play. He wants the ball the time back into Merrick. Oh my days. He played it outside of his foot. What a save keeper. Great save. By the way, commend that pass. Respect it. We go back in. Jay Burke tries to carry the ball up. We've got the ball on the right hand side with Bobby. And he goes into the side net. Maybe he had to try and pull it back. That's Jake with a free kick. He's hit the ball. I tell you, look, he's found his range. Sam was scrambling again there. Maybe the sun was in his eyes. Someone give him a, someone give him a your fresh hat. Anyway, we're still in the game. Harrow back on the, on, on the attack. Back on the ball. That's Jake again. He's come alive, bro. I'm telling you, the kid is a player. He's a player. I've known him for a while now. I've seen him play. Merrick just needs to get it done, have a turn, but people need to give him information. So we're back in with Jake. Jake plays it into, oh, he just played into the fullback. It's picked up by Jay Burke. Jay into Merrick. Merrick's trying to do a bit too much. I think he's trying to change the game, but he's done well to win it back. Surely that's a foul. Don't worry, he'll sign his shirt on the way out, son. Gaffer looks nervous. He's looking for that curtain. A big error is coming onto the pitch. Good feet. We wonder what error we're going to get today. Baruch as well. Good player. Very good player. Both of them are good players, to be fair. To be fair, that's testament to Harris Boots to be able to leave them two out and bring them on. They're both very good players. So we see how they change the game. Come on, Lionel, mate. Taking your time. Sam Freeman on the half time. Loves half, halfway line. Loves having a chin wag. Anyway, Rye rolls out and gets, gets the ball forward into Merritt. Merritt goes back into Rye. There's a bit of urgency about Portland's playing and they're trying to play forward into Jay Burke. Jay Burke comes back to Rye. Rye's looking for a pass. Plays it inside to Pricey. That's a foul. That's, I told you. They're hungry, Harrow. Harrow are hungry. Pricey wasn't happy. That was a bit late. And it's that mate, man, Jake Francis again. Yeah, he's hungry now. He's had that bang look and he's back in it. And it's on the ball. Goes into Jay Burke. Jay Burke goes out right to Merrick. Do you know what, right? Merrick has done a fair few bits since he's come on. Tommy Backshaw on the right hand side. Gallivant in run down the side. Gets intercepted. And we go in, we're back in play. And now Ride Dog, Ride Dog's been all over the place. It's a kind of, and it's loses the ball. And we go down the right hand side to Bash. You won't catch him. Oh, decent. He's touching pass him. That's a foul. That's a foul. Corner comes in. Great header away. And Portland get it away. Bit, the, you can feel there's a bit of a bit of urgency about Portland's play, but they're, they're looking a bit indef, indecisive as well. Jake Francis goes into error, error on the ball. What can he conjure up? The ten dog. Which one in? To be fair, it's not a bad ball. Just no one's attacking it. I think that's gone out of play. No, it stayed in. So to be fair, that's a great stop by Sam Freeman. And it's on the ball again. Goes inside to Owen Price. Nothing can't go forward. He's going to have to go back. No, he's not. He's going to go forward. It's poor ball by Price, he's better than that. But Anis nicks the ball off Eric's feet. Eric, this ain't walking football, you're supposed to run. Yeah, Anis is on the ball again, he's driving forward. Slips him, Jay Burke. Jay Burke down the left-hand side, can't go anywhere, so he has to come home. Into Hanif. Hanif goes into Anis. Anis little flip around the corner to Merrick. Merrick's looking for an opening. 
Goes out to the right hand side. It's a great ball out to the right hand side. Goes forward into the wide area, I believe, with Bobby. Bobby gets across, ball across, but it gets blocked. Tries to go back in again, but there's no one there. Header away from Tommy. Uh, Ever doing his defensive duties, but it's been knocked, nicked off his feet. He's trying to win it back. Rolling, is that a foul ref or not? No. Nope. To be fair, it goes into the edge of the bottom of America again. Fake shot, stop. Looking for a pass. Pass goes into Owen Price. Owen Price is looking to go wide. Dinks it into the foot. Oh, dinks it into Leacock. Great first touch by Leacock. Plays it down the line, but it's nicked by Simo. Simo into Jake Francis. Jake Francis sets a full back. Oh, but Sam Freeman, the old sweeper keeper, is out there to clear his lines. Back in play. Harris pulls back on the ball again with Jordan Simmons. Jordan Simmons is looking up for options. Can't see anything at the moment. Minute. Making his way down the left-hand side. Still on the ball, having to come home. But to be fair, he's had the ball for about... Oh, what a ball to Bass! If Bass had anything about him, he did bicycle kick it. And Eric couldn't get on the end of it. Great tackle, Eric's lost the ball. Tries to go inside to Anis. Anis loses out. Ride Dog loses out as well. He gets a shot off. And flipper shots there. Back down the left with the Simo's having a bit of joy down this left-hand side, to be fair to him. But he loses out there. Ride Dog on the ball again. Right door goes into Jay Burke. Jay Burke comes into Anis. Anis loses out. Tommy's been on him all over him like a rash, like a fox on a bin bag. But his mate Hanif helps him out. Hanif and Jay, Jay good link up play. Goes into Merrick again. Been very comfortable on the ball, Merrick. He's got good feet. Anis, Hanif done well again to get the ball back. Can lift, uh, hey, this is a piggyback ride. Hanif's won the foul. Owen Price goes home. Gets back on the ball again, goes forward into Anis, pops it back to Pricey. Pricey goes forward again, goes into Jay Burke, Jay Burke into Anis. Ball gets nicked off his toes and sets off Harrow Sports but can't find the right pass. Sam Freeman once again sweeping up. He's had a good game today, he's a great keeper. Go back into centre half, Jake Hill. Jake Hill goes into Simo at left back. Simo's driving up the line again, great feet by Simo. Shoot! Get your shot off Simo, he's got a great left foot. Great block, Sam Freeman, comfortable for the cameras. Telling you what, this has got extra time written all over it. Sam Freeman thinks one out to the left-hand side. And he swings, and he swings a header, you know. He's stepped up his game. So Hanif's taking the throw from the left-hand side. Goes back into Price. Price has been a very, very good today, you know. He's done a lot of lot of things. Portland's done well. Commentators, because he loses the ball. Berusha on the ball goes down the right-hand side. But there's no one supporting him. But he wins a throw in. Big throw by Big Bass. He don't skip arm day. Jake! This guy, I'm telling you now, yeah? Shooting practice, he's got techers out the side. Pepe Reina team. Yeah, he don't mind. Yeah, anyway, Cocky back on the ball, goes forward, goes into a great area down the right-hand side. That definitely looks offside. Goes across the goal! Oh, that is sad. That is sad for Jake because he's had a good game. He definitely looked offside from where I was standing as well. Jake's a centre back, he's a good centre half. He tries to defend it, a little bit of lack of communication between the keeper and Jake. And if the game ends like that, I do feel sorry for Harrow because Harrow have been really good. They, they pushed Portland and pushed Portland. Do you know what? This has got glimpses of that Kenny Moore Portland game. Portland with a better side, but they lost 2 1. So, anyway, we're back in the game. Harrow now a bit more urgency about it. Jake picks up the ball deep, goes long into a left, into an attacking left side area. Touchdown by Jay Burt. Right dog plays it out to full back. Hanif, Hanif on the ball. Looks up, can he go forward? He can indeed to Merrick. Great touch with the outside of his foot. Sets him into a wide area. Bit too much on it for Anis. Keeper comes out with a little dummy. Held R1. So Tommy Batshaw gets dis dispossessed by Anis on the line. Anis tries to go down the line. Do you know what? I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. Tommy Backshaw's done really well against Anis. He's made Anis think twice about what's a, what he wants to do. He's gone tight, he's let him turn, and he's won a little battle between them two, which is really good, because Anis is a big player. Tommy brings the ball out, he looks up, he's looking to dink the ball down the line, which he does well. Into Baruj, great first touch, by the way. Turn, that's a foul. Baruj, what a touch, take a bow, son. Jake Francis reached the ball in, but it's defended really well by Portland. There can't be much longer left. And Anis again trying to do a bit too much on the line. Error on the ball, gets a cross in. And the head out is it's headed out for a goal kick. Jake Francis back on the ball again. Goes into Tommy on the right right back position. Tommy's on a on a, on a 
That's a foul ref. That's definitely a foul ref. To just let a few things go to, there's been a few dubious position, deci um, decisions, especially that second goal, but that's great feet by Bobby. Do you know, arguably, I got my two MOMs today, and we're, and we're talking about that at the end, but it's going into Hanif right now. Hanif goes back into Ride Dog, Ride Dog back into Hanif. Hanif goes into Merrick. They're keeping the ball well, little triangles, tiki taka. Yeah, Ride digs it into Hanif. Hanif drives forward, tries to draw a foul. Is he going to get it? Yes, he is. As he said, which one ref? So Ride Dog. Back in, pops into Merrick, gets it back to feet. Just go home. Look, look at that safety by the Portland Gaffer. That go home talk. Yeah, don't want to go forward. Yeah. Anyway, ah, oh, pricey. Them feet, they are. So anyway, Portland back on the ball. But I think now that second goal's killed Harrow Sports. Really, it's sad for them really because they've done really well over the over the course of the game. But Portland really controlling the game now. Maybe looking to try and nick the third. Um, keeper cleans up really well. Keeper's made a couple of good saves today as well. Kush back on the ball, looking up to set. Harrow on the attack, driving forward up into the halfway line. Goes into Bass. Oh, Bassy boy with them little things there. FIFA Street. But it's dispossessed. And it's back on the ball. And it's driving forward, slows it down. Still on the ball. Can he move it and don't lose it? Good lad. But Bobby loses. I think that's the first time he's lost the ball. Jake's got the sat nav back on. Plays in. Jordan Simmer on his right foot, I'll have a tea with that slice. Anyway, they can't there really can't be much longer left now, maybe a couple of minutes left. And it goes to Tommy in the right back in the right back position. And he's driven forward, he's still in the ball. Comes back into Simo. Simo goes on his right foot, then back onto his left foot. And it's to shut him down well and force him home. Great ball into the middle of the park. He gets his head up, dinks it in. Comfortable for Sam Freeman. Simo's got the up now, look. To be fair, he says sorry. The game's been played in really good spirit, so I think that's just frustration from Jordan Simmons. Kush puts, puts the ball forward again. Great header. Great, a great header there. Sorry, just a bit of a interference there. But anyway, headed out of play. There's a late corner for Harrow Sports. They're sending everyone up. Head up. Sam Freeman, safe hands. Safe hands. Harrow were off their bench. They thought he was going in. Great header by Ray, he's been all over the place again. Every week we cover him, he definitely has good games. He's getting better and better for our cameras. But he's always been a baller. Don't let us kid you. Plays into Anis. Anis gets a block in. I tries to set the counter attack again, but keeper comes out and, and does well. And, and it's working on oh, his full time. Full time in the Sunday League FA Cup. Portland 2. Harrow Sports 1. You got the goal in it. You got the goal in it. I just want to shake your hand, cuz. Huh? Yeah, just shake your hand, cuz. I told you, you got the goal. I said you're a freaking future all star. Here we go. Future lamb. Hey, hey, hey. What do you reckon? Talk to me about today, bro. I'll be honest, it's a bad performance, man. How are you feeling? Tired, man. Tired. Yeah. What do you think? What do you? What did you think of Harold? Honestly, then, sure. You underestimated them. Underestimated. You know, we know a lot of their boys, and when I looked on paper, they got a very good side, but. They were saying to me that the, the, the league they're in, they don't, they don't feel it, it's, it's great, but they want to get across. There's no disrespect to the league they're in, by the way. But you won. Yeah. Do you know what I was looking at? You dominated Ken you beat Kenimore, dominated Kenimore last week and, and lost 2-1. And I don't think you played great this week, but 1-2-1. <laughs> That's football for you, isn't it? What do you reckon? Yeah, same. I think, obviously, I, I think from the boys, I think because we knew it won a Kenny Wall, it won a Essie Dons, it won a Rocker. Mm -hmm. Everyone took their foot off the pedal, man. And myself included. Mm -hmm. But the competition is bigger. The competition is bigger. So if we lost, everyone would have been like, fuck. Yeah. Through to the next round, though. Yeah, man. Show me that key. <laughs> hey, listen. Your first TV sports, 90 minutes done. Out. Portland 2. I predicted it. I've got one right. <laughs> yeah, I'm back. <laughs> Sunday league game, 2 1 Portland to my left. I got Dan Portland Gaffer to my right. I got Ryan, Harris Sports Manager. We'll start with you, Ryan. How do you think the game went? I think we was unlucky. I think um, first half it was 50 50. I think we were both in it. I think second half we took control of it, just didn't take our chances. I think f that goal gave you that extra bit of yeah, yeah. calibre of yeah, the goal, the way it went in. Jake, 
the strikes on real to be fair. There's not many times Dan, that we see Sam not knocking enough. The fact that Sam never got near it yeah, is testament to how good the goal was. Yeah, I weren't too sure it went in, to be honest. I had to wait for the ref to, to, to <laughs> point. Yeah, because of the stats. Exactly, yeah. And there was a little debate of, of a hint of offside. For, yeah, for, the, for the second one. The, God. <laughs> the, line, the lino was a bit of a lump, to be honest. Yeah, exactly. about, five, about five yards behind it, but we'll see. We'll have well, a look what, at the what league are you guys in? Uh, Leverhead and District Prem. You're in the Leverhead and District Prem. Yeah. Guys, it's definitely your first season going to come down a couple yeah, of yeah. This, our, this is just this our second season. So oh, last last year, season. We started last year. So. Right, listen, we'll catch up. Yeah. Thank you very much for nice having one. us today. Cheers, nice mate. Dan. Cheers. Dan. <laughs> Gaff. I said to, do you know what I said to these guys last week? You were the better team in Kenilworth and you lost 2 1. I argue tonight, I don't think you're the better team that you won 2 1. What do you think? Me, personally, I told them in the change rooms at the start of the game, we set our levels last week yeah. and we dropped our levels this week. So, yeah. um, they should have won today. Do you think it's hard to replicate a performance like you did last week? Very hard. It Very is. hard. We've got to keep it going. Like when you're playing teams and in our mindset, they're like, oh, they're from a different league. Mm -hmm. we could, we, we're going to beat these. Well, that's our mindset. Last week, our mindset was we need to set the record straight. But so, sometimes you've you got to just applaud certain things. That goal was serious, wasn't it? That goal was top quality. Top quality. But I think I would have saved it, Sam. <laughs> but that. listen, you're free to the next round. You're, you're in the hat, no? In the hat. That's what matters. Who do, you want, who do you want next? I'll take the hand with Oh! Yeah? Where's Winch? Where's. <laughs> wait, you heard it here first. Another <laughs> 90 minutes done. Portland 2. Dan, can you tell him what my score prediction was? Your score prediction was 3 1. Mine was 2 1. Nah, don't try it. <laughs> 2 1. But listen, your first TV sports, 90 minutes done. Yeah, on to the next one.